Welcome back to the channel. This is the Earth Science Classroom. In this video, we're looking at geology and where modern geology originated from or was founded by. And when this is in discussion, we have to talk about one man in particular, a Scottish geologist called Charles Lyell. And this is what he did to become the father of modern geology. This is the Earth Science Classroom. Charles Law was a Scottish geologist born a little bit north of Dundee in Scotland in 1797 and he was aware of both Steno's work in geology and stratigraphy and also James Hutton, his fellow Scotsman, his work on the brand new uniformitarianism principle of geology whereby the past is key to the present and vice versa. He took these great thinkers in geology and the beginnings of geology and really just made it more concrete. And in doing so, he looked at both the intensity of the process of uniformitarianism and the method by which processes occur on the Earth's surface. And again, confirmed the Earth was much older in terms of deep time than it was previously known to be in terms of the religious ideas and the Bible teachings of it being 6,000 years old, Charles Lyell confirmed and supported James Hutton in this deep time theory of the earth based on the rock strata, the rock processes, and of course, uniformitarianism. And he also looked at unconformities as well. There was a groundbreaking publication by Charles Lyell called The Principles of Geology. Now there are three volumes, first in 1830, the second in 1832, and the third and last one in 1833. So over the course of three years, these volumes basically listed and very accurately and in much detail listed all these ideas about uniformitarianism and the differences and variations within this principle of geology. So much that these natural laws and these ideas that Lyle put forward form the basis for modern geology. So he's known as the father of modern geology. And these volumes are basically looking at each part of uniformitarianism. So the process is one, the nature of it and the, the biology component is volume two, and the processes through geology time is volume three. So when you combine the work of both Steno, Hutton, and Lyle, you form a very comprehensive basis for modern geology and stratigraphy and how the rocks form, the processes, the rock strata, the bedding, the environments, the landforms, and we can use these principles to understand the Earth's landscapes and formations. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, please subscribe and hit the like button. If you like more on this content, please check out my channel, which has all these videos on Earth science.